Hello and welcome to my 3-minute thesis presentation. My name is Sama Beganovic and I will try to bring my doctoral research a little bit closer to you. The topic of my thesis was production of polyketide pharmaceuticals and nutraceuticals by using metabolically engineered actinobacteria. And this brings us to first question, what are polyketides? So polyketides are chemical entities that contain multiple keto groups in their structures and they are natively produced by thousands of different bacterial, fungal, but also plant species. In addition to keto groups, they also contain a variety of different underfunctional groups that enables them to perform different biological activities as shown in box one. And this makes them excellent drug candidates. And in our project, we've worked with industrial producer of a broad range antibiotic called oxytetracycline. In nature, oxytetracycline is produced by a soil dwelling gram positive bacterium called Streptomyces ramosus. In industry, the, in, the producer strain was developed from this wild type strain by a series of random mutagenesis imposed by UV light and different sorts of chemicals. So we were interested to, to compare this wild type strain, which produces only few milligrams of oxytetracycline with the industrial strain that produces oxytetracycline on a gram scale. So we applied systems biology tools and compared the two strains on level of genome, transcriptome, proteome and metabolome. And what we could see is that despite heavy genomic rearrangements, which were probably imposed by UV light and chemicals, the metabolism of hyperproducer strain was perfectly streamlined toward increased production of oxytetracycline. This was resembled in activation of the supply of oxytetracycline building blocks, acetyl-CoA and malonyl-CoA, showed here in box number two, but also uh, by activation of the genes within the oxytetracycline biosynthetic gene cluster. So these are the genes that encode for the enzyme that catalyze synthesis of oxytetracycline. At the same time, the genes uh, or the pathways that were withdrawing acetyl-CoA were downregulated. Finally, this motivated us to remove, to delete the biosynthetic gene cluster for oxytetracycline from this industrial hyperproducer and create a new platform strain that could be used for production of other interesting polyketides. And this brings us to the end of my presentation. Thank you for your attention and I'm glad that your curiosity brought you to my video.